This is the 2021 Math Kangaroo Levels 3-4 Problem Number 18. Seven cards are arranged as shown. Each card has two numbers on it, with one of them written upside down. A teacher wants to rearrange the cards so that the sum of the numbers in the top row is the same as the sum of the numbers in the bottom row. She can do this by turning one of the cards upside down. Which card must she turn? A, C, D, F, or G. This is the problem as it originally appeared on the test, so you can pause the video now if you want to try it on your own first and then press play when you're ready for us to go through the solution together. So I started by finding the sum of the numbers in this top row. We have 7 plus 5 plus 4 plus 2 plus 8 plus 3 plus 2, which is equal to 31. Next, I found the sum of the numbers in this bottom row. 4 plus 3 plus 5 plus 5 plus 7 plus 7 plus 4 is equal to a total sum of 35. Well, the problem tells us that the teacher wants to rearrange the cards so that the sum of the numbers in the top row is the same as the numbers in the bottom row. So right now we have a top row with the sum of 31 and a bottom row with the sum of 35. So we can see that those two sums are not equal. What's the difference between them? Well, we have a difference of four. So four divided by two is two. So we want to increase the top row sum by 2 and decrease the bottom row's sum by 2 in order to have the same sum on top and bottom. So if we do 31 plus 2, we get a total of 33 on the top. And on the bottom, if we do 35 minus 2, we also get a total of 33. So we want, again, sum of 33 on the top, sum of 33 on the bottom. So now let's look at our cards to see which ones have a the top number and bottom number differ by 2. So here they differ by 3, here they differ by 2, here they differ by 1, here they differ by 3, 1, 4, and 2. So we have B and G are two cards where the two numbers written on them have a difference of 2. However, we want to increase the top row's sum. So for B, if we flipped it and 5 went to the bottom and 3 went to the top, we would actually be decreasing the sum of the top row and increasing the sum of the bottom row. So our correct answer is G, because if we flip it and the 4 goes to the top, the 2 goes to the bottom, the top row will have a sum that is 2 greater than what it currently is, and the bottom row will have a sum that is 2 less than it currently is, and we would have a total of 33 on top and bottom. So our correct answer is answer choice E. We want to flip card G. Thank you so much for watching, and please subscribe if you would like to see more videos.